I should be where I'm needed. And this is where I'm needed. I'm a trauma surgeon. This is a conflict. Trauma is every day. I must be there. When you watch the news, you see like, for example, five injured, six whatever, uh, 20 injured. Those five injured or 20 injured, this is not number. Those people, their father, their mother, their child, their brother, their son. I get to know that. My dad, he, he was a trauma surgeon. And even before, uh, when I was a student, he told me, be anything but not a trauma surgeon. But if I'm not going to stay here, or if I'm not going to do it, who will? Nobody. Any human being has the right to have an access to healthcare. Facilities are very basic, very, very much basic. When we talk about hospital, people think that hospital is like hospital, something which is in the movies or whatever. It's not. Somalia is far away from that. You feel like your hands are tied, particularly when I know that the cure is simple and easy, and, but I don't have it. Being a humanitarian worker means I care about people and I have uh, enough morals and uh, thoughts and ideas and ideals to follow that and to do my best to help them. My worst fear is to go to grave with my knowledge. I need to make sure that I pass it before I go. I, I'm not taking it with me. If I could stop something in the world, it would be war because I find it a stupid thing. I'm a big time stupid. People are dying because of what? Land? Who's more precious, the land or the people? The people.